Hey everyone, it is so good to spend time with you today. And I am holding up this right here, a calendar. And I bet a lot of you have a calendar. Maybe you have one of your own. Maybe you have one that hangs up at home um, that helps you keep track of what's going on. Maybe your parents have one. Maybe there's one in your classroom at school. And class, these calendars are all over the place because they are handy and useful. They help us plan and they help us stay organized and they help us remember important things that are going on. And, you know, I like to plan. I'm kind of a planner myself. And Barry, I'm wondering if God has a plan. Uh, I, I like to think that God has a plan. I bet God has a plan. I don't think God's plan necessarily syncs up with our calendar. I think there's a bigger plan that's unfolding that we might not understand, but I think it's, I think it's good. I think the plan that God has for us is good. I have great faith in that. Yeah, I sometimes my plans do not go the way that I want them to. And you know what? God always supports us and loves us, <laughs> even when our plans are not going the way we think they should. So that's a good thing. So on our calendar, the first day of the year, January 1st, we call that New Year's Day. And on New Year's Day, a lot of people like to make resolutions and predictions. Barry, just what is a resolution? I think of resolution like uh, an intention. We use the word intention quite a bit. And I think uh, when we set a resolution, it's like something that we want to focus on in the new year and bring our attention to and, and just set the idea that I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get that done this year. And a lot of people set resolutions and um, not everybody follows them, but I think it has to do with our uh, uh, kind of our instinct to want to make our lives better. And I think that's what resolutions are about. So prediction is an interesting word. A prediction is basically a guess about the future. So I don't know for sure what's going to happen in the future, but I can guess what's going to happen. And a guess might be something kind of obvious that you know is going to happen. Like um, I get to celebrate my birthday this year, right? That's a guess that's probably going to come true. But some guesses are really far out there. Like people will start to live on Mars. That's a pretty big guess. Um, the whole world will run out of sugar. Ah, can you imagine? That is a really big guess. Will those things come true? I don't know. When people make a prediction though, they're saying, I think this will come true. So predictions, a guess about the future. And you know what? We have a few predictions about what God is thinking about for our next year. Barry, what are we thinking? Well, one of the things is that no matter what happens, God always supports us. I predict that that is true. And that uh, uh, no matter what happens, God hears our prayers. And it's always good to be in relationship with God and to have faith. And, uh, you know, I predict, I predict that uh, things are going to turn out well in this next year. And that uh, God is holding us and that uh, we are loved. And I think knowing that... Um, helps us to be uh, to be optimistic and to be positive about what's coming up next. Even though we don't know what it is, I predict that it's going to be good. I love it. So we actually have an affirmation for you that goes with this idea of calendars. And our affirmation is God loves me every day of the year. God loves me every day of the year. All right. Well, you know what? We love you too. And we look forward to talking to you again soon. Happy New Year.